Hello everybody, Namaste from Canada. Uh, it's been uh, more than a year now. I am here in Sault Ste. Mary. Uh, so uh, in today's video, I'll be sharing my experiences being here in Sault Ste. Mary for more than uh, 14 months. So be with me till the end so that I can share my likes and dislikes uh, being here in Sault Ste. Mary. So let's start today's video. So let's start with the likes at first. Uh, the first thing uh, what I like about Sault Ste. Mary is like people uh, living here. Uh, they are so friendly uh, they welcome uh, you as a friend and uh, they also help you uh, in uh, in some circumstances so uh, that's the good thing and the second thing is housing and the uh, uh, housing here is quite affordable in comparison to other big cities uh, for a single person if he is living in sharing basis uh, he he can stay uh, in 300 dollar per month and if he choose to uh, stay in private room he can uh, find a room uh, for around 450 uh, plus and that's a good thing and the next thing is about uh, the environment uh, the Susan Mary is not so big city so living here is a quite nice place uh, not so uh, crowd and not, not much traffic so uh, it feels like you are living in uh, along with the nature uh, uh, this is the nature of Susan Mary uh, this is Su River and behind me you can see the ducks and geese uh, so uh, living uh, in Sioux is a quite nice place uh, being around with the nature and you can enjoy and be a part of nature so that's a good thing and the fourth thing uh, will be the uh, transportation uh, transportation can be taken as benefit or as a, a minus point as well because the transportation cost is uh, quite cheap but uh, it's uh, it's not that uh, accessible for all the places uh, I'll be talking more about uh, transportation in my dislikes part and uh, it's it's available uh, for throughout the city uh, uh, for your access uh, you can uh, go wherever you want uh, with the same bus pass uh, for a month or for a semester for a student Al Algoma students uh, can get bus pass uh, through Algoma University uh, while uh, for the Sioux College student they have to buy uh, by their own and uh, the last point uh, will be RNIP program uh, as uh, Sioux St. Mary uh, lies in uh, northern part of Ontario so it comes under RNIP program so it's uh, also a benefit uh, as RNIP is uh, extended till um, February 2024 I think it will be further extended I'm not sure about it uh, that's all for the likes so now let's talk about the dislikes uh, as and Mary is small city so uh, there are no such uh, entertainment and employment opportunities available here as compared to Toronto area uh, there are only few places uh, which are open till midnight and most of the places uh, shutdowns are by 9 or 10 p.m. so uh, that's a bad thing and there are uh, there are also not uh, not many places uh, for your entertainment purpose so uh, i think uh, that's a bad point if you like uh, entertainment and crowd area uh, another thing will be the grocery uh, the grocery available for us is enough but it's quite expensive uh, like uh, green vegetables are quite expensive here and uh, we uh, we we don't have much options for that if you want a uh, got meat uh, it's uh, hard to find here so um, for grocery it's a uh, little bit in downside uh, the next thing will be the transportation uh, the transportation available here is only for the city route and not for the far places uh, uh, if you want to go uh, if you want to visit uh, any far places uh, beside the city area so you need to find a, a private ride or you need to own a car so that's a bad thing and even if you want to go to the airport uh, it's a long way so uh, you need to have access to a private ride or your own a car uh, that's all about uh, transportation now um, uh, the final point about this uh, my dislike will be <laughs> the city of Sioux and Mary is far away from the Toronto like uh, uh, in a private ride or in a car also it will almost take you seven to eight hours and uh, by plane it will take you an hour so uh, that's a bad thing like if you have any related work uh, or like uh, the things that you can't uh, get here 
it's a far uh, toronto is far so you have to make some time and visit toronto and get back here so uh, i think uh, that's all for the dislikes living here in sault st mary and in canada is a a good experience uh, so far uh, except the winter like winter is harsh like uh, um, uh, the minimum temperature i experienced was about uh, minus 25 uh, so uh, if you don't like winter uh, that's a bad thing uh, here in sault st mary and in canada as a whole uh, so uh, make mind about uh, all the things uh, before coming to sault st mary and thank you for watching video till the end and if you have any uh, comments uh, regarding sault st mary please uh, let me know in the comment section that's all for the today's video uh, see you in another one bye bye